the social impact. Thanks to the increase in social media sites, the way we socialize has changed. The three main social impacts of the internet on individuals are listed below. Social interaction. Humans have a need to socially interact with people. Thanks to the internet, we can interact with people from across the globe. However, many people feel that virtual connection is replacing face-to-face -face connection and that that's a bad thing. Personally, I don't see this as a problem because it's not how you socialize that's important. Psychologists still debate about this topic particularly its influence on the younger children. Cyberbullying Cyberbullying is the use of internet to send text, images, videos or other things to upset or embarrass someone. Online bullies could spread disturbing images online, often edited themselves. Something unique about cyberbullying is that the bullies can hide their identity, making it even more traumatizing for the victim. A side note, it is easy to identify who the person is through the device that they are using. Physical activity. Obviously, with communication apps and online stores, we have to hardly move from our seats these days. Sadly, this can have many repercussions. Your health can be very damaged if you don't work out properly. There is an argument that games that promote physical activity often encourage people to get physical. Do you agree? When it comes to online safety, there are three steps that you have to follow. Sip it. Keep your private information to yourself. Be careful what you send about yourself to strangers or post publicly. Some personal information would be your location, phone number, school, private email, address and unwanted photos. Make sure to check your privacy settings in any of your social networks. Block it. If anyone hates on you or you get a friend request from someone who is a complete stranger, no mutual friends or anything, just block that account. If you are below the age of 18, try adding a safe search filter to avoid inappropriate content. Flag it. If you are deeply upset about something you saw or some message someone sent you, talk to an adult. If anyone tries to send you threatening or inappropriate messages, report them to the social network. Digital Footprint A digital footprint is all the data that a user has created online, recorded and stored. Most information that you share online always stays in the database, forever. So before you post anything, think about these questions. When I look for a job, what will employers think when they see this? Would I show this to my parents or relatives? Would people misinterpret this? Is it fine if people I don't know see this? To reduce your digital footprint, you can close all social media requesting to delete all archives, Reading the terms and conditions of social media networks. Search yourself online and see what comes up.